Well, you ain't called to Clem's Electronic Workshop or, uh, what's left of Call to Clem's Electronic Workshop because it had a bit of a disaster. Look at this. The bench fell down. It came undone from the wall. Fell down with an insane clatter, which woke me up. Although at the time I just thought it was a noise in my dream. Because I often, I'm often waking up by noises in my dreams, but... So I didn't really think anything of it. And then I got up to this. Unfortunately, everything seems to have survived. The scope seems to um, still seems to be okay. That still seems to be working. I haven't tested this little one yet. We'll do that in just a minute. Yeah, so I've got to rebuild this bench. Doesn't look like anything. I don't think anything has gotten damaged though. And yes, you are seeing a smartphone there, but I don't use it. Mum insisted that I get one, but you can see by the amount of dust on it that I don't even use the damn thing. Yeah, I'll just give this a little test. See if it's alright. Let's see. Uh, let's see if Got a few alligator clips out already, just to see. All right. A 9 volt battery probably isn't the best power source for this thing, but I'm only going to be doing this for like a few seconds just to see if this still runs. Oh, yeah! It's still okay. It's booting. Yeah, so that's alright. Like I said, it's probably not the best idea to run it on a 9 volt battery because I don't know what, how much power that actually takes, but... I've got to put all this back together. So what a lovely job that's going to be. And... Still got all this to do, my animation and everything. Well... I guess Aperture Labs is on a bit of a hold for now. So yeah, I just thought I'd post this so you just know what's going on. Anyway, it's cool dude Clem and yeah, until next time, goodbye.